you shared about being in the auction business at an early age and can you just cover the transition and the differences from later model cars to collector cars that that was easy for me the transition for me, when, when i started in the auction business i literally got as much mileage as i could and i sold just about anything as an auctioneer i sold cattle, I sold horses, I sold heavy equipment, I sold late model cars, uh, I sold oil field equipment, and I also sold collector cars. And while I enjoyed parts of all of those things, the passion that I had for cars is what I think finally steered me to narrow down that focus from be, being a hired gun auctioneer where you'd go in as a, a contract guy and, and your expectation was to perform well regardless of what you were selling. That I, I just, I, I always found that at the end of a week if I uh, did a couple of late model car sales and maybe some industrial equipment and jam in, I used to do five or six auctions a week when I was quite a bit younger. The ones I truly enjoyed most were the old car auctions. That led me to a place where I knew I was going to be in the auction business. I really loved it. What did I want to spend my time being around and auctioning and, and, and investing in and talking with people about and enjoying old cars. So for me, that was very easy.